Where are we going today? Um, to a rock. On top of another rock. On top of a really big rock. Sounds good. So like I said earlier, we are going to Overlap Stone, which is about 20 minutes south of here. It's supposed to be a pretty cool lookout and a little bit of a hike. It's a rock on top of a big, big rock. On top of a really big rock. We've read that this road's too steep for motorbikes to go up, but we don't know when to stop. So I guess we'll just keep going until we can. So we saw signs on the way to this rock saying that the road becomes too steep for motorbikes. Mm -hmm. We need to stop and hike. So that's what we're gonna do. <laughs> This is gonna sound weird, but it smells really, really good up here. The air smells perfumed, like a fruity perfume. It's really nice. Doesn't look like it, but it's pretty steep. How you doing? Yeah, they said not to touch the ropes, right? Yeah. <laughs> it's exactly what they said it was going to be. A rock on top of another rock, another rock. It is actually super impressive. I mean, that's a huge rock. We're standing on the other one. <laughs> and the view is amazing up here. A little high for my taste, but that's just me and my fear of heights. You okay? You anxious to get off of this? A little bit. <laughs> You ready? It's lunch time. Hmm. Hmm. That was honestly pretty cool. From the description we thought it would be kind of eh. Yeah, I mean a rock on top of another rock, but it was actually, <laughs> I don't know how it got there, 
probably erosion, but I'm not ruling out like a super strong person. <laughs> oh my God. It was, it was pretty cool to see yeah. though. And we were really lucky that there was like just one or two other people up here. Oh, and it's a uh, 50 baht per person. To get in now. So mm -hmm. it was about $3 all in for both of us. Which isn't bad. Mm -mm. All right, on to the next. Whoa, so steep. Wow. Probably can't see on camera how steep this road is, but it's incredibly steep. So I'm leaning back as far as I can to try to slow us down so we don't cook the brakes like we did uh, at the last one. We're taking you guys to a slightly different rock now. It's called the Grandmother and Grandfather Rock. It's basically right across the road from where we just saw the overlap rock. It's starting to feel like we're just wandering around the, uh, the jungle. Yeah, this trail looks really overgrown. Um, <laughs> So I hope we're going the right direction. We'll see. All right, so we ended up in someone's backyard. So we're turning back around and see if there's a different way there. It's the next way. Okay, we're pretty sure we were in the wrong area altogether and we need to go further down this road over here. We went for a nice stroll through the jungle. <laughs> yeah. So Okay, this looks a little more like it. It was one of our faults that uh, we parked in the wrong spot. <laughs> All right, here we are. Where's Grandfather Rock? So that's Grandfather Rock. Legend has it that a long time ago, these parents had a son that was coming of age and needed to find him a wife. So they uh, took a little wooden boat out to sea to go to the next province. And they ended up dying at sea and they washed up and turned into these rocks which I guess it's supposed to represent the intentions of the grandmother and grandfather. There's actually a lot of people here. <laughs> this all... is uh, quite the attraction. Everyone's doing these little giggles. <laughs> <laughs> Now for what I'm really excited for. <laughs> First coconut ice cream in a long time. By a long time, she means like three days. That is so good. Get shaved coconut. That's very good. Why can't coconut ice cream in the U.S. taste as good? I don't know. Don't so eat good. all of it. No! No! There's definitely a storm brewing and we don't have rain jackets. Alright, time to go.
All right, so like we were saying, it looks like it might rain. Mm -hmm. So we did this thing a little while ago where we went to a food court and ordered each other food. And now we're gonna try it again. Yeah, why not, it was fun. You want something to drink? Yeah. Did you not put the lid on? Oh, <laughs> that was not me. I think I'm gonna do that because Trivia is really hungry. Is that chicken? I think it's pork. What's this? No idea. <laughs> I like this is a salad. That looks good. Yeah, trying to be a little, little healthier. Alright, so I'm guessing you got me beef noodle soup. It was actually freezing in here, so it's perfect. How's the, the broth? The broth is so good. It's just super hearty and there's a lot of seasoning in it. How's the beef? The beef tastes like it's been stewing for a couple oh. hours. Super soft and just breaks apart. You did a good job. I haven't seen one of these in a long time. A knife. <laughs> I think this is mashed potato. What? That is mashed potato. The sauce is really, really strong though. Mm. Is that good? The pork is perfect. It's so good. So how did I do? 10 out of 10. This is really, really good. <laughs> Honestly, it is. I had one drink of this. <laughs> I was thirsty. Lunch was great. Mm -hmm. It was just a little Six. under seven dollars. Yeah, pretty good deal. Always food courts, they're the best. Tonight is our last night in Koh Samui. We keep coming to this bar, Lebdi's, just down the beach from us to play pool and just hang out and drink beers. It's been a great time on Koh Samui. Mm -hmm. See you guys bright and early tomorrow morning. Bright and early. Good night. One day. That looks so nice. One orange satellite disc? That's a hammock. Dummy. Oh, is that what you're playing at? Yeah, oh. dummy. <laughs> ran into a plant. Okay, this is actually the first 